for the first three centuries or so, the, the, the early Christians got it. I mean, they were a yeah. minority. They were persecuted. Uh, they, they had to be willing to die. Um, you know, they, they weren't out there trying to you know, tell Caesar what to do. They are just trying to live out the call of the gospel. And the church spread yeah. like wildfire just because of the, the beauty of the, the, the countercultural lives that they lived. Mm-hmm. Um, well, then, you know, early 4th century, this emperor Constantine allegedly got a vision that he thought was from God. If he had a vision, I think it was from the devil. But the, the vision said, if you, you know, paint the Cairo, the, 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 the CR of, of, uh, for Christ, on the shields of your soldiers going into this very important battle, I'll give you the victory. First time that Jesus mm. and violence were ever associated, mm. that I know of. Mm. And so, but this is how pagans think. You know, I want the yeah. most powerful right. God fighting on my behalf. Right. So, then I'll slaughter more of them than they slaughter Manipulative magic. Right. right. Can, exactly. And it's, he's it's, the new deity magic. in town that seems to be growing in popularity. Well, he, so, somehow Constantine got that in his head. He mm-hmm. did it. Painted the Cairo on mm-hmm. the on the shields, and he won. He, he won this battle. And the next year, he he then legalizes Christianity, uh, and Christian Christians start to come into power. He starts throwing money at the church, throwing power at the church. Starts building their nice buildings and all that mm-hmm. kind of stuff. Uh, within 70 years or so, it becomes then the official religion of the Roman Empire, which means it's illegal not to be Christian, though they made an mm-hmm. exception for Jews. Mm-hmm. And w- th- the year after that happened, we find uh, the first example of Christians putting a non-Christian to death, mm-hmm. a killing. Right? And now we're, we wow. start acting like the pagans did. Well, we don't but, do well at stewarding power. No, no, we don't. Yeah. Uh, no, there, there's something, we weren't meant to pick we, up the sword. That's the minute it. we pick yeah. up the sword, you put down the cross. Yeah. But see, then what happened, it's just, it's just crazy. Because Satan offered Jesus all the kingdom of the world, all the power of the world. Yeah. Uh, Luke mm. chapter 4, mm. 5 and, and, uh, through 7. And Jesus said, no, I, you know, I'm going to get all the kingdoms, but I'm not going to do it that way. Huh. I'm going to do it through the Calvary way, the slong mm. and low, uh, faith, faithful way. So Jesus saw, and the gospel authors see, the temptation to grab hold of power as a, as a temptation of the devil. Yeah. Fast forward it to the time of Augustine, and you have people like Augustine and Eusebius and other church fathers saying, oh, God has given us the power to run the world. And, and you know, uh, St. Augustine said, if God's given us the sword, well, then surely we w- w- must use it for his name. Hmm. And now we're going to try to take over the world following the way of the crucified Messiah. It goes by the wayside. Uh, we're soldiers just like the rest of the world. We just are soldiers in Jesus' name. And yeah. we have a long tradition of that. So I don't think they're intentionally trying to not notice the passages about loving your enemy or whatever. Yeah. It's just that there, there's a long tradition of indoctrination yes. that keeps them from seeing that. I was there. Hmm. I, I never, up until, you know, I think 10, 12 years ago, I never really got how central hmm. nonviolence, peace, loving your enemies is to the gospel. Now I, now I think it's the center. I think it's really? the center of... of it yeah. certainly is the ultimate test case. Because uh, nothing is more contrary to our fallen self than loving your enemies mm. when your life is on a line. Mm. And so nothing is more distinctly Christ-like mm. than giving your life for your enemy. Mm. Uh, it, it's, it's, I think, the ultimate you mm. know, shibboleth, the ultimate test huh. case. Wow.